How does it feel to win one of these games? Oh, it feels good, man. It was a close one. We uh, fought all the way. And uh, I got to congratulate the defense for doing a great job holding them and uh, giving us the opportunity to get one last drive and just put the nail in the coffin. Just that quick reminder, when was the last time you guys won on the field? I can't remember the time Oh, uh, I have no idea. That was, I think that was my first time ever having to rush the field. That felt good, and that, uh, it was great, man. Uh, Jake Whitecloth, he deserved it, and he made a good kick. Talk about that last drive, just what, what came together on that last drive. Um, we just made a decision to stop trying to get X plays and just execute the plays that we had at hand. Just take what they were giving us. Uh, they had a good defense. They covered, pretty, they covered real well. And they also had a D-line that rushed real well. And, um, so they had a great overall defense that limited us to some things, but we had to just take what they give us. Coach Golden said he thought that he thought that you were pressing a little too much early on. Do you feel like you were? Or were you oh, I kind of felt like I was trying to to get a big play, but they was covering. They was covering real, real well. It was on plays that we expected big plays to happen, but um, at the end of the day, you know, their corners are good too. Jacory, I know you guys have the pressure kicks on Thursday. How much nervousness did you have for it to come down to that field goal? Oh, I hadn't. I wasn't nervous at all. I just was ready to rush the field. I had confidence, you know, in, um, in Jake. He's been doing it for a while, so, you know, I'm glad he got his opportunity to get a kick like that. Jacory, what does it mean for you and the rest of the seniors to, to get that six win and be pulled out? It means a lot. You know, we fought real hard this whole season. We had a lot of ups and downs, uh, but we all fought through the adversity, and, and we're here today where we at. You ever been to Shreveport, Louisiana? Oh, uh, never been to Shreveport. I have. I think I have rolled through. I rolled through. <laughs> <laughs> is it Southern in Shreveport? Uh, yeah, no. Southern, because my mother, my mother went to school there, so we rolled. Louisiana. Yeah, we yeah, might be rolling through again. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that'll be cool. <laughs> Are you what? relieved to be bowl eligible? Is it uh, a weight off your back? Uh, I pretty much knew we would get there. Just uh, we just had to take care of business, so it's not really a relief. I could pretty much expect it. Were they doing anything special on defense that you guys didn't expect? I mean, uh, no, they they weren't. Uh, they just played football. Uh, that's why it was a tough game like that. It was almost like the LSU Alabama game. Just uh, going back and forth, uh, two defenses playing tough and playing hard. Was it just effort on their part? Like effort. They were just playing hard as hard. They were playing hard. They were playing hard as they could, and uh, and we were doing the same back. Just that we uh, pulled out at the end. What did uh, OT bring the offense? He's our short yardage back. Even though he's the little guy, he's someone that that protects very well. He understands they all of his protections, and I trust him back there to the point where I'm not even worried about anything when he's back there. And uh, when we handed to him. Um, uh, on short yardage, she has like a his head is shaped like a mohawk, so it's like almost like an arrowhead. <laughs> he goes forward and he, and he gets the first yard, he gets the first down. So you're pretty confident he'll always get it. Yes, I'm pretty confident. Jacory, have you ever won a game without scoring a touchdown? Oh, I don't think so. I think this is my first time playing a game without scoring a touchdown. So um, uh, you know, it's a great win. Felt good, and I'm just happy that we got the W. I'm happy for OT. He's he went a long way to get to this point where he's got this role now. I'm very happy for him. He's a guy that worked hard in practice, and then it shows out here on the field. Thanks, Ryan. Yeah, thank you, guys.